Hello friends, welcome back to the shop and welcome to a new series where we're going to be working on this pipe which it belongs to a friend of mine named Father Anthony. Uh, Father Anthony is on YouTube as Mearsham Piper and you can also find him on Instagram as Long Island Piper. So Father Anthony got in touch with me, actually it's been over a year now, I'm, I'm embarrassed to say and asked me if I could do something rather interesting with this pipe. So, as you can see, it's a, it's a rather beautiful uh, pipe in that it's got this nice bamboo. Um, the stem is, is, is quite fitting for it. But in his opinion, and frankly in my opinion, the bowl is just out of proportion with the rest of the pipe. It, it's just enormous, and it, it's also very heavy and kind of awkward to smoke. He doesn't particularly like the carvings on it. So he asked if uh, it would be possible to actually graft another bowl onto this pipe. And, you know, initially I thought, gee, that's a crazy idea. But, uh, you know, I like to do crazy things, so, <laughs> so why not? So we talked about it a lot, and uh, he's been very, very patient as I've gone through many uh, ups and downs over the, the past year plus, uh, just trying to get the shop remodeled and get everything back in, in working order and catch up on customer orders and everything else. He's been great about it. Um, and we've talked back and forth o over time to try to come up with a plan for what we were going to actually do with, with this pipe. So we found a pipe, uh, and this is just a picture from Smoking Pipes. Uh, and I actually did not uh, remember to write down who the maker was of this pipe, so I apologize for that. But as you can see, this is this is a um, much shorter length of bamboo, and you can tell just because of the space between the nodes here. Um, and the bowl is, is much smaller and, and really more elegant, more kind of uh, curved and almost brandy-like. Uh, maybe it is brandy. Um, which just would seem to suit this better. This this looks more like a, I don't know, like a, a club or something, whereas this just looks like a nice, elegant pipe. And we both agreed that this shape would really be fantastic. So the question is, how do we get a bowl like this to put onto a pipe like this? And I've got a couple of possibilities, and I'll show you right now that this is one of them. So I have this um, Mearsham, uh, Mearsham, Briar Bowl that is uh, partially finished and maybe you can see there's some uneven spots here. This is from a factory uh, that shut down before it was finished with all of its pipes. The air draft hole has not been drilled yet, but the tobacco chamber is. This is about the size that Father Anthony was saying he liked. It's not unlike the shape of the bowl here. Keep in mind, this is not to scale, uh, you know, but, but a similar shape bowl, and I think it would it would it would actually suit this very well. Now, we're not gonna put it here because that would just be kind of ridiculous. Uh, we're gonna cut this bamboo, and I think that if I do it right, if I catch it right here between these two nodes, I will be able to use this bowl. I'm, I'm going to remove a lot of the shank, but I'll be able to use this bowl hoops and it will make a reasonably sized pipe. And I think that this will match up pretty well. I am going to have to make an ebonite spacer that goes between, uh, it just acts as a transition between the, the briar and the bamboo. And you can see that's done here on, on the original pipe. So there's a lot that we need to do here. We need to uh, cut the bamboo, we need to face it off, we need to make the, uh, the ebonite transition piece, we need to cut the stumble, we need to, well, we need to shape the stumble, finish shaping the stumble and get that all smoothed out. Uh, get the ebonite piece to link up here. I'm not sure exactly what's going on here. I would imagine there's some stainless steel tubing in here. We'll see if we can reuse that and uh, make it work with this. So I'm not going to do any drilling or anything with this until I know exactly what I'm going to do here or here. Um, yeah, and that's that's basically the, the story. So if by chance this doesn't work, 
I've got a couple of big blocks of briar. We'll just make one and we'll make one that will work. So we will wind up with a smaller, more elegant pipe at the end of all this. Now you might think this is crazy. Uh, it is, but it's going to be fun. <laughs> and that's what matters. As long as we have fun, it, it doesn't matter how crazy other people think it is. So I hope that that will not discourage you from uh, joining us as we take this journey. Uh, I have no idea how many installments this is going to take, but I will certainly be trying to put them out uh, about once a week. And I hope to get this finished up pretty quickly because I'd really love to get it back to Father Anthony. So folks, thank you for watching. Please be sure to like and comment and all those good things. Your subscription is always much appreciated. And until the next installment, I'll look forward to talking to you all again very soon. Bye now.